Hi, it's Susan from Decorating Magic. I asked viewers what kind of video they'd like to see next, and one viewer said she'd like to see a bright, colorful kitchen that was not cookie cutter, and mine certainly fits that bill. Now, don't get me wrong, there's lots of things I'd like to change about my kitchen, but until I can, I'm just gonna make do with what I have. Like, for instance, I'd like to get white quartz countertops, I'd like to get cabinetry where the doors actually close, I have hardly any cabinets, so I've used a hanging rack to store my pots and pans. And when you do this, don't put so much stuff up there that it feels like it's gonna fall down on top of your head. Now over here is an old bookcase that I got at the thrift store and just dry brushed, and I filled it with my colorful plates. It just looks bright and happy. I also like to have house plants in my kitchen. Plants just bring life to a room. Up here are some Spanish bowls that I got in Spain when I made a trip with my sisters and my mother. But I actually lived in Spain when I was a little girl, so some of these are my mother's. But I love the happy colors. It just makes a room feel inviting. The colors on the wall is a Benjamin Moore color called Dill Pickle. Now, let me talk about this table for a minute. I've got a long, narrow kitchen, so we needed a long, narrow table. So this is a table that my husband and I made from a pallet. Now the boards on top are not pallet wood. Those are actually cedar planks from Home Depot or Lowe's that you would buy for fencing. And I just chalked, painted them, and sealed them. Here is the other side of my kitchen. My kitchen is sort of chopped in half, so the work area is really quite small, as you can see. We call it a one-butt kitchen. I'm going to be putting uh, links to products in my video description, so please look below if you're interested. Now, these guys are called First Stones, and they're actually from Italy. You give them to someone for their first house. Over here, I have some Talavera platters. Talavera is from Mexico, and I actually got these at a thrift store, believe it or not. Those are my mom's jam jars from Spain. And then I use some tal Talavera tile around my sink area just to give it a little pop of color. I still put things on top of my cabinets, but I make sure there's something interesting. These are water jugs from Spain. There's a Talavera chicken. There's some terracotta vessels from Spain. These are things you can find at thrift stores or online. I have some old vintage towels I display. That was my mom's. It's just fun to put some color into the kitchen. Let me talk about this cabinet. This was my mom's. It's so useful for me because since I have hardly any storage, I've got it jam-packed full of stuff. And I just painted it, distressed it so that it would fit into the kitchen decor. But pieces like this, if you can find them and you have the room for them, they are totally helpful in helping the room function. Like I keep my craft stuff in this cabinet. Well, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Look for the links in the video description. And I hope I've given you some good ideas. Thanks for watching.